What I learned today is to become much more aware of some of the threats that uh, religious communities are facing. I represent a religious community that, that doesn't have so many threats, eh? quite safe, uh, but to be aware that there are other religious communities that, that, are, uh, that, that face much more threats, uh, which makes me more aware also to, to take a closer look at our own practices and things that we do. I found it very enlightening and I kind of get a more broader scope of things. It was always more the fire safety and first aid and that was about it, but now I see a much broader scope. My takeoff today is that it's actually very important not only for the place of worship to have all uh, security in place, but most important for the uh, uh, people who are visiting or worshipping in that place of worship. And this is a matter that you have, we, we will have to be looking at different uh, aspects of what is security and how we can provide this for the audience in specific and in general. Very much, I mean, the details are plenty. Things that we normally take a look seriously or things that uh, are not noticed uh, in a normal scenarios uh, is that wall all have been put in a very detailed manner. The, the very structure of this program is quite uh, interesting. And some of the terminologies like Jasper, so it, it uh, makes us easy to remember them and kind of reflect on things that we are doing on a daily basis. So to that standpoint, I think today's training has been quite effective. Yeah, I think they could, some of us could take training still. Um, it, I think it's indeed powerful to, to learn from an expert, uh, from all angles of view. Um, uh, In-house learning can be less, uh, taken less seriously. Um, well, the importance of being aware of security in public places, mainly. Um, I've already gone through this because in France right now we're living the situation because we had a fire and there was no alarm system and everything, so we had the visit from the health and safety and they were very unhappy with what they saw. So we're going, we're, I'm learning a lot this year about health and safety, so this was kind of like a cherry on the cake. I was very surprised when I got the email at first um, I was thinking where, where does this come from uh, another interreligious uh, meeting and then I read through it I was going actually this is a good thing to um, to think about so when I came here it was more like open I don't know what to expect now I've been here I was thinking okay this might be a, a good place to start with some training or at least to develop that awareness that I don't tell them but maybe someone else outside will tell them it, it always helps I mean I'm a familiar face People might agree or not agree with me within the church, but it's sometimes from outside, it's a good voice to, uh, to convince people.